Item number SCP-984 Object Class Safe and Pettis Special Containment Procedures The facility where SCP-948 is located, hereby Site-48, is currently under the auspices of Company, a Foundation Shell Corporation. The door to SCP-984 is to remain externally locked at all times except during experimentation, as are all stalls at SCP-984. Only Class D personnel may enter SCP-984 without protective armor and a firearm. No less than three Level Zero medical personnel are to be stationed at Site-48 at all times. Should SCP-984 become activated for any reason, these personnel must be called to SCP-984 to provide medical attention to any persons exiting SCP-984. SCP-984 is a restroom located in Upon recovery, three light bulbs were found smashed. Under normal circumstances, SCP-984 is only unusual in that it has been partially soundproofed with commercially available materials. SCP-984 will only display overtly anomalous properties under the following conditions. No persons are in any open areas of SCP-984. Exactly one stall in SCP-984 is occupied by exactly one person. The door to said stall must be closed and locked. At least one light fixture in SCP-984 is non-functional or off. Should the above conditions be met at any time, one or more instances of SCP-984-1 will materialize inside SCP-984 once a person exits a stall. Specimens of SCP-984-1 tend to be large, highly aggressive mammals of varying species. All SCP-984-1 specimens disappear 9 minutes after manifestation. SCP-984-1 will not willingly leave SCP-984 for any reason, and will disappear if it is forced to do so. Instances of SCP-984-1 will display symptoms and mannerisms characteristic of a mid to late stage infection of rabies. However, unlike most rabid animals, SCP-984-1 will display marked hostility towards humans, particularly any persons who enter SCP-984. As persons in SCP-984 are not typically prepared to handle dangerous animals, victims are often bitten several times before being able to properly defend themselves. In cases where at least one specimen of SCP-984-1 is particularly large or strong, it is possible for SCP-984-1 to kill the victim shortly after manifesting. Should the victim survive being attacked by SCP-984-1, they will experience significant confusion regarding the events that transpired in SCP-984. In some cases, victims will attribute their injuries to mundane phenomenon that would not normally cause said trauma.